Well, we finally decided to buy the pool after hemming and hawing and debating over it and contemplating it and thinking about it and praying about it and all the excuses to put off making a decision. Then finally, was it my dad called Your me dad called. and said, Did you buy that pool? No, not yet. Then like a day later, her mom calls her, Did you buy that pool? Not yet. She comes to me and says, Do you think we should buy the pool? I think they all just want to swim in our pool and have us put up the pool they and maintain the pool, but they want to be able to come and swim. They wanted us to do the work. We do the work. We're suckers. They get to swim. We're the suckers. We should have made them get the pool. Next time they get the pool. They live so far. It would be difficult for them to make it to the pool though. So. So anyways, Holly gets online and goes to the to the Walmart website and pulls up our local Walmart that's terribly local, what, 30, 45 minutes away from us? It's the closest Walmart, like yep. 30 minutes away. And uh, they're out of stock or showing that they, they don't. They said that there was, they had none in stock. And we had just been there like a couple days before and seen two on they the They said shows. they had none in stock. So she, so she starts panicking a little bit starts frantically looking for other stores that have We've them. missed our chance. There wasn't one and then the next one over and there wasn't one. So it was like... And there wasn't one anywhere in the town that's closest to us. So within one. within like in 45 minutes there wasn't. So it was quite literally like seven Walmarts away. Yes. We had to pass seven Walmarts before we got to the one. Right. And so she orders that one and she's like, whew, we got one. It's, it's store pickup. Store we'll be pickup. Ready later today. So I've got to go into town. I'll just drive my truck instead of my work car, and it'll all be fine. I'll it's go like pick it up. It's like an hour away. Yeah. So, two hours later, she gets a notification. Some items in your cart have been canceled. There was only one item. There's only in one your... item in my cart. Yeah. It's been canceled. They weren't in stock. I have a theory, but it was it. They canceled it. And so she jumps online again, and now I find the only other one in our area so nine nine walmart's over now oh i think it's more than that which one was it so, i thought it was in nolensville well nolensville road in nashville yeah but that's that's only one more walmart past the Antioch one i don't know maybe anyways anyway so she orders that one we wait two hours and she's like I think we should be good now. I think we should be all right. And they're gonna hold it for us for a couple days so we can, you know. Because it was really far at this point. Right, get off of the pool, stupid dog. And so, she's still gotta go into Walmart and pick up some things, because I think we needed some stupid stuff like milk and... Toilet paper? We didn't need toilet paper. We had lots of toilet paper. We have all the toilet paper. We haven't even opened that one package. But we're not hoarding the toilet paper. We we're just. Not. We just buy large packages of toilet paper. And you get the toilet paper, the one ply, the thousand sheets in a roll, because then your kids don't like to use it. You're way off on the tangent. You, you got to stop. Anyways, your kids don't like to use it, and so they don't like pull off gobs of it. They're like, no. It's, it's not a pleasure. So they don't enjoy it. You know how some toilet paper no. is just a pleasure no, to use? No, I never, I never think of that ever. Like you pull it off? No. And it, and I don't it, think, oh, this is so nice. And it no. feels supple in your hands no. and it tears so nicely and cleanly. No, that's dumb. I know. Never. Someday, when we don't have kids, maybe we'll start buying the nice toilet paper. I, I, I will not care. Oh. At all. You'd do it for me, though. What you okay. So anyways, so she's got to go into town to uh, to our local Walmart and oh your parents were coming the next day and you had to pick up some stuff for lunch. Something. That's what it was. So anyways, so she goes in We were Walmart. out of s'mores. We were out of s'mores. That's what it was. And we were going to use the fire pit. So, so she goes into Walmart and the first thing that she does she goes into I just want to see the pool section. If there are any pools back there since they told me there weren't. And sure enough, 
the last one on the shelf, sitting right there, is this baby right here. So we ended up, she went I, I, I bought the pool <laughs> three times. She, she calls me, she's like, they've got it here. What do you want to, me to do? We wouldn't have to drive an hour and a half to get it. I was like, well, go ahead and buy it. And uh, as long as it'll fit in your car, because she was driving the Flex, as long as it'll fit in your car, we should be fine. So she goes into the hardware department and grabs a tape measure and starts measuring it to make sure it'll fit. And yeah. It did. So she had a, a couple of... I wish you'd had your video camera watching those guys try to load it in my car, though. Well, if it was anything like us it trying was... to load it in the truck. <laughs> oh, that was entertaining. Um, so she bought it three times, and uh, luckily Walmart was gracious enough to, to refund us the other two since... But it would we could have... We could have had like dueling pools. Like girls in one pool, boys in another pool. That's actually a great idea for we our could particular family. Put up a net in between them and then we could play pool volleyball. I bet we could have rigged it so that, you know, we could have like connected the two with like a tube and swum. Swam. Swum? Swum. Swum? <laughs> because swum. I was homeschooled. I had an excuse. Uh, Don't in say that. The Half two. our nation is homeschooled right now. Well, that's true. They all have excuses. So they all understand the word swum. So we bite it three times, and then it's been sitting in our mini barn, waiting for a good day for Holly to give the hardware store a call and figure out how much it was going to cost to get sand. Which it wasn't a good day for that. <laughs> we put up this pool in sweatshirts. And umbrellas. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Um, all right. So that's our story. That's how we bought our pool from Walmart. Walmart has great return policies on things that you don't pick up from their pickup. But not during COVID. All right. And their app lies and says that they don't have things in stock when they do. And my theory is that the person in the pickup didn't want to have to go and get this big old heavy pool and drag it all the way to the back. So they just said it wasn't there. That's my theory. I think there's a bug on my shoulder. Where? I felt it land on me. <laughs> Alright, we'll see you guys sometime. What's our next project? Finish the patio. Finish the patio. More dirt. That's tomorrow. It's going to be warm. It'll be great. Dad's coming. I'll put him to work. Your poor father.